lay back and crack this window I've been doing my best Taking a moment to rest Feeling stressed out Give it a good I put that on God when it gets hard I stay on my job like no day not too bright let me fix the light i don't know y'all i gotta kind of figure out this light because i'm turning the percentage down but it doesn't look different i hope it's not too bright um as you can tell from the back of me this house is a mess can't really see yeah but just know my whole house looks like that we've been on the road for the week um and we came in from a load, dropped everything, got had to get up five, four o'clock the next morning to get ready to be. We have to, it takes two hours to pick up, right? So if we have to be there at seven, I'm just gonna take this off. I just have my natural hair out and it's in big twists. I'm just gonna take this off cause it's hot. So in order to be there by seven, we have to leave by five, which means we have to get up at four. So the next morning we came in about seven o'clock, maybe, yeah, maybe about seven o'clock, six, th well, we got into town at six, 15, but we didn't come go home. We went and got diesel. And from the gas station, we went to Ingalls so we can get something to eat. So we were probably home about seven. Now my husband was in the bed at eight, but I had my favorite SD card, my Sony SD card that I love because it matches my camera, because my camera's a Sony. I wanted to transfer all of the footage um, for, for another channel off of it so it would be ready for the next morning. And by the time I tinkered around with video and and saving stuff in folders and all of that, had dinner, got ready for bed, it was about 9, 9.30. We were up at four, out again, to pick up that was yesterday and then we came home and basically just laid around so the house is a mess um dishes need to go in the dishwasher i did i did wash two loads of clothes yesterday while i was laying around um we ended up taking a bunch of stuff that we got for our grandbaby over to her house it it we just didn't do anything in the house so this morning i woke up sick of my bathroom and when we get in there you guys are going to see why but I'm taking a trash bag with me. And if I haven't used it, if I've never used it, if I haven't used it in a year, if I haven't used it since I've been here, it is going in the trash bag. Like it's ridiculous the amount of stuff that I've collected that I just don't use you guys. So yeah, that's what's happening today. So I'm gonna get my cup of coffee. I'm gonna take my medicine and then we are going to get in the bathroom first. The whole house is gonna be attacked. We're gonna do the bathroom and the bedroom first and then come in here. My husband has somewhere to be at uh, two o'clock. I can't talk about it right now, but I'll tell you guys about it later. I'm so excited for him to have this opportunity to do this. And so he has somewhere to be at two o'clock and then we are going to uh, I'll probably start cooking after that, but I want to take the morning to to clean, and then while he goes where he has to go, he's being picked up. So while he goes where he has to go, I'll probably go to the grocery store and find something for dinner. Um, last weekend I did a chili; it was really good. Today I want spaghetti. I want a homemade, good homemade spaghetti. So. Um, I'll probably do that. Um, yeah. So let's get into it. <laughs> 
my coffee just finished. I'm gonna make a cup of coffee and then we'll get into it. attention to me putting coffee in the coffee maker the can said cafe brulee so we finished that can of coffee and it was good but it was kind of strong and i was using two and a half to three scoops and it was perfect the coffee that's in the can now uh, is a bag of starbucks coffee and it's the caramel flavor and I made a pot out of it, and it was just too light, too light skin. So I um, did, and the pot that was too light skin, I think I did three scoops. So the directions for that coffee pot, that built-in scooper, says three to four for a full pot. So I did four scoops today of the Starbucks, and it's perfect. It's, it's really perfect. It tastes like coffee. It doesn't taste like watered down coffee. It wasn't too light. Like my cream would look super milky. Now, it, I mean, I like a lot of cream. I don't know if you can see it. Because I'm not looking at it. Um, let's see. Can you see it? Okay. So anyway, it tastes good. We're going to get right into it. I'm going to clean and deodorize the toilet and let the cleaner just sit in there. And then I'm going to start under the cabinets. Now, the top of the cabinets look terrible, but there's no need to deal with those until I deal with underneath. And you'll see. say this is a project that I do not want to start but I have to this coffee is so good this is the worst side so we're gonna start here okay cleaning supplies are from here over these are cones and stuff. Let me pull that out. And you know, let me just say this. Now, a big reason I haven't used a lot of this stuff is because I wear braids a lot. I made up in my mind this time that I'm going to try to wear my natural hair for maybe a month. We're going to see. Y'all know I like braids. So... I feel like the best way to tackle this is to pull everything out and decide what goes back. So, I think this is Epsom salt. These are sponges that don't have to go in here. So, I'm going to trash that. Cleaner. I 
I've been alone For what seems like forever Try to hold it together But I'm losing my grip I need someone Who can make me feel better Wrap me up in a sweater Treat my pain with a kiss Then suddenly you are here Inside my head everywhere Where did you come from? I'm wondering Baby, are you made up of for real? Say, can you feel what I feel? Cause I can tell if I'm just dreaming I I do use these brushes and I try to keep them all in this bag because so they stay in one place. These brushes help clean the shower. So where the track is for the shower door, a brush like this is really good because it fits in that track and I can swirl if stuff, stuff is built in. And little Brushes like that, I can get under the track. And and um, these brushes help me like get in corners and stuff like that. So I ordered this pack of brushes from Amazon. And if I can find them online again, I'll send them to you. This is Epsom salt. We use it in the tub. I'm gonna stick that back there. Into your driveway, it's a Saturday night You look like a million bucks wearing that dress I like You're smiling but there's something missing in your eyes Girl, I can tell that you have something on your mind But I will make you forget all your sorrows Let go like there's no tomorrow Let's have a drink, just relax, all your problems will fade If you're ready for a good time, count on me There's a party in the backyard, dance your problems away I'm all about the good vibes, I know you're all about the good vibes Do you know how much I love you, wanna see you smile Where's the happy girl that I know with the heart on fire? I'll do anything to make it fine, but I can tell that you have something on your mind right now. But I will make you forget all your sorrows. Let go like there's no tomorrow. Okay, you guys, I'm feeling a little bit happier. It's still a lot of stuff. When you have natural hair, you have a lot of stuff. But I'm feeling a lot happier and a lot more organized. So we're going to start from left to right. Right here, this this is three sections here. One, two, three. So right here in the front are all my hair oils. So now that I get to experiment with my natural hair, or now that I'm giving myself the opportunity to experiment with my natural hair, I need to figure out which one of these oils works best in my hair. And as I um, realize what's not working and what is, I can throw them away i kept this bottle because i like to mix oils so this is a good bottle to take some of these oils and do my own mixture that's why i kept that bottle so i'll probably get rid of some of these bottles here shortly like this wild growth miracle oil i think it's a mixture of different oils i'm gonna i'm gonna put it in here but I didn't want to start getting into stuff like that right now. I just wanted to get this organized so I can move on to the next thing. This next section is all my got to be glue stuff. I have styling gel. I have the spray. This is a sulfur eight hairspray. Um, my edge brushes are right here. And then in the back, I have hair treatments. So, I definitely, definitely know that this Afogee treatment 
It's really good for, for your hair. I haven't used it in a while, but I'm going to keep it and do it. And then I love this Aztec Secret Healing Clay. Um, it's really, really good for your hair and for your skin. It's about time I did another one of those. That's not something that you want to throw away there. And this bottom container. <clears throat> I need to pull this out so I can show you. This bottom container is excess stuff. So I have, y'all, if y'all haven't used these, I'm going to show you in this video somewhere how I use these. I stopped putting washcloths on my face and I use these. I'm going to show you. And then all my extra detangling brushes really good brushes you use different ones for different things this is a scalp um brush for when you shampooing and then all of these have different purposes dimming brushes and different things and then more detangling brushes so and this is also for when you're shampooing so that's what's in there and that's not something that I pull for all the time, so I left it down there. Okay, in this container, this is like twisting creams, scalp conditioners, stuff like that. This is a root rinse. It's a apple cider vinegar root relief. These are mousses. All of these types of containers are mousses. This is, these are other products that I'm not sure which ones I like and I don't like. So I didn't want to throw away something that would do good for my hair. So now I have the opportunity to experiment it, experiment with them. This is also a scalp cleansing treatment. And I have hair moisturizers and stuff like that. That's what this container is. This is also root relief. This next one. These are gels. So this is Curl Haze Shine Gel. This is more like to make your hair curly, but then I also have like, um, if I'm gonna do twists, that kind of gel, regular gel, edge control, stuff like that. I also have shine sprays in here. That's the oil-free shine spray, curl moisturizer spray. That goes over there. Those are scalp sprays. So th those are the types of things and also hair grease. So shine sprays and hair gels in here. My, the rest of my combs and brushes are back there. I just stuck my two water bottles right here and this goes on trips with me. Um, a small um, mouthwash, I just stuck it there. So when I'm preparing for a trip, I can grab it. That's my uh, Uncle Funky's. I'm going to use that in a hairdo here soon. So I'll put it right there. On this side, I put all of this stuff in a bag because I only use this when I have braids. And in one of these containers, it just takes up too much space. So these are hair scrunchies and also bun makers. So depending on what size bun you need, I have big ones, I have little ones, medium sized ones. It's like two packs of bun makers and then all my hair scrunchies are in the bottom. This little one is like hair clips. So these types of clips as well is these types of clips. So all kind of hair clips are in here. And then in here, I have all kind of hair pins, um, hair ties, all kind of stuff. Uh, the little small silver hair clips. If you can see down in there, I have a bunch of those little tiny black um, rubber bands. See these little, I have a million of these. So that's what's in here, you guys. 
And these are bobby pins. And this was actually empty, but I found, and then I do have these types of bobby pins. The, the, the uh, let me show you one. The clothes bobby pins, I have those. And they're full of them in here. But these are the open bobby pins. So like if you're doing a bun or something, let me show you. These are more of the open. So as I found them, I put them back in here so that they were easy to keep separate. And then, of course, you saw I have soaps on this side. And I have little different accessories over here. Like these are extra. I bought a big pack of edge brushes. These are ones I haven't opened. These are those detangling, I mean, the hair catchers for your sink. These are good, you guys. If you like a bar soap, what you do is you stick the bar in here and close it up. And then you exfoliate your skin while you're taking a shower. I've got one in the shower already. And those are extra that haven't been used. So I stuck those in there. That bag of Epsom salt is up there. And then cleaning supplies is over there. So... I feel much better. I failed to show you what it looked like before I got started, but I'll show you more bobby pins. But I'll show you, um, and I'm going to stick this here in case I got something I need to put in that bag. I'm feeling I'm gonna show you better what already. Doing. I do have some stuff accumulated up here, but I took some, put some stuff to the side that I wanted to figure out what to do with, and we're going to do this top part next. This is the trash bag, though. So I got a lot accomplished. It probably didn't look like I was putting stuff in the trash. I was keeping everything, but I really was. I kind of like this hairline when I bought it, but I did. I got like little sample sizes because I didn't want to keep investing in stuff and I didn't know if I was going to like it. I'm going to shampoo my hair today and I think I'm going to try this line because I'm going for a curly look for my hair for our spiritual meeting tomorrow. So I put this to the side, which probably doesn't go well <laughs> with the stuff that I put to the side, but I'm gonna keep. So I really feel like the last time I used this, it didn't go well. I didn't like it, but it's got a $14.99 hair price on it. And also I already threw away I just feel like it didn't go well, but I don't remember. I threw this away. It says $16.99. It's a honey curl foaming custard. I think I just need to wash my hair and try it one more time. And if I don't like it, just throw it away. But I don't remember. So I'm going to put this in here in the hair gel section. This is Sulfur 8 Spray for Braids. Definitely keeping this. Peppermint Aloe. This is on the sink because I used it the other day. I think I'm going to use it when I wash my hair. This is Kim Kimball's Healing Leave-In Conditioner. It's rich in avocado, jojoba oils, and fortifying amino acids. I It's full. I've never used it. I'm going to keep that carrot and tea tree oil therapy i can mix this with um my oil concoction so i'm gonna stick that in there hand scrub we'll give it a try these are facial products some of this stuff was already up here and this is sor sorbeline moisturizer it's a plant-based lotion i took it out because my lotions are gonna go over there this is gel i used it the other day um I found some of my hair stuff that I like, but I don't use all the time. So this is a, um, it's by Neutrogena and it's a micro abrasion type thing. Love it. So I took it out to put it on my sink. This is something I do like once a month. Took it out so I can see it because you don't see stuff, you forget about it. So all this stuff is going over here. This is a to brush your, um, clean your skin. I, you know, I'm kind of torn between throwing this way. I'm kind of torn, but I really don't, you know, I really don't, I don't use it. 
I'm going to throw that away to cut it down. Okay. Coconut oil, so good for your hair. I'm glad I found it stuck way in the back. I wanted to bring it to the front so I can start using it. I'm kind of excited for trying different things with my hair, but I'm not a hair person, so this is going to be interesting. But I'm going to learn how to take care of my natural hair. You think that I should calm down and that I'm Okay, I told you I was going to show you how um, those little sticks work. So what you do is when you're getting ready to wash your face, it's water activated, right? So you just run it under water. See it expanding? So you just put your facial soap on it, clean your face, and then rinse it off. And they say you can use these for a week. I do use them a couple times before I throw them away. I just let it air dry on the sink, but it's a great sponge. And I told you I don't put washcloths on my face. And so... I've been using um, the Clean Skin Redefining Cream. They're like towels, but they're like a cross between material or fabric and kind of like a really thick paper towel. You can, and I'm not gonna waste them because they're they're a little expensive. They're like almost 20 bucks for this pack of 50. But when you when you um. Rinse it and rinse your face off. You can use it for multiple things. You can shower with these. So they come in different sizes. This is the XL. Maybe when I'm cleaning my face or something, I'll show you. I don't use them in the shower, but I do use them for my face. I meant to get a bamboo box to keep them in. My space on the sink is limited. So I don't know. We'll see. But I definitely want to show you how to use those and I bought a pack of like 250 so that's why I have so many I was using these ones I think I've shown them to you before they do the same thing you put them in water and they expand into a, a little see one's flat and it gets thick so very good so those are good. Love them. Now I'm going to put these to the side and dry because we're not going to waste nothing around here. Overthinking everything about you And that we're good the way we are
me say them tears to go, my life be like yo Nu vill jag kunna ge tillbaka allt jag inte kunna ge förut Det finns ingen annan där som kan stå här by my side Oh why? Sätt ett ur rör på det får mig och dör för dig baby För de här jadis jadis De vill ju bara dra ner oss Men du är fett och vanlig På det jag lägger av min tid och Jag vill ha dig, ha dig Du får mig känna safety Ni kan nog le dig baby Och jag kommer aldrig ändra mig So happy, no going on, 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 Ja, det ser jag det De vill ju bara dra ner oss Men du är fett och vanlig På det jag lägger all min tid av Jag vill ha det, ha det Du får mig känna safety Ni kan nog le det baby Och jag kommer aldrig ändra mig Aldrig, aldrig, aldrig Kommer aldrig känna så här för någon annan Bebek så allt när jag visionerar vår framtid Låt mig hålla dig baby Hej, yeah, hej, yeah. hej Kommer aldrig känna så här för någon annan än dig Aldrig, aldrig, aldrig Kommer aldrig känna så här för någon annan än dig Jag vet det bara live om jag aldrig Jag vet det bara ta din tid I wanted to do this is uh coconut oil finally got some stuff done that I wanted to do not a bad morning it is let me see 102 and I finished about 12 30 I've been on my computer I've been on my computer um, taking a look at video for the next weekly vlog. I've been trying to get weekly vlogs out on the vlog channel every Sunday. And I'm still thinking if I'm going to do this clean with me on the vlog channel or the mobile home channel, because it is about 
cleaning our mobile home. So more than likely it'll go on the mobile home channel this week along with a weekly vlog that I already have um, recorded on the blog channel. So I also am probably out of mobile home videos. So I'm going to have to travel, but today's Saturday, Monday, we'll be out of town in the trucking business. So it'll have to wait. I'll probably resume mobile home videos, tours in January. So I just want to take those twists out of my head and make my hair look halfway decent. I'm going to get a manicure and a pedicure real quick. I'm not going to, I'm not going to get color because I have so much polish here. I need to really work on self care. And I'm in that self care mode. That's why I'm doing my own hair. That's why I'm gonna try to do my own nails. Y'all know every time I try to do that, it just don't work. But we're gonna try it again and see what happens. So, that's where I am with that. I'm looking in the camera to do this. My hair is kind of dry. I'm going to wash it and blow dry it and put it in a ponytail. But tomorrow, I saw a video on YouTube that I really think I can do. And so I, I grabbed some hair that I already had, and I'm going to try to do it. If it doesn't work out, I'll take it out. And um, if it doesn't look good, I'll take it out and um, do something different. But I really think I can do it. I really Doctor.